A recent report by Red Seer has estimated that there are 240 million short video users in India, a number that is predicted to grow even further to at least 575 million by 2025. In our next special address, we'll hear from Mr. Ajit Vargis, Chief Commercial Officer, Share Chat and Moj about the short video space, digital growth frontier ahead for Bharat. Welcome, Mr. Vargis. Thanks, Annie. Wonderful for having me here. Uh, as you are aware of this uh, subject, uh, how, how short video space is actually changing the frontier of Bharat. I mean, we all know that we live in, in a country with 22 major languages, 1500 dialects, thousands of festivals. Uh, I mean, today we, we all see that much closer to our home because of the one medium, which is uh, access to internet and especially the growth of social media. I mean, if you look at if you look at the social media growth, what has changed over the last five six years? I think first and foremost is the is the access to internet changed in two thousand fifteen uh, uh, with the advent of four G, and that that actually made the big difference in our on, in our ecosystem in terms of adoption of social media across gender, age, geography. That was no longer a barrier. Look at it this way: there are six fifty million internet users today. Uh, five years back, it was closer to 300 million. So it is probably doubled in the last five years. Uh, however, if you look at social media users, it was close to 100, 110 million in 2015. And today we are at around 450 million users in, in social media. So that's almost grown by 4x. So if you look at if you look at the typical challenge that we see across any adoption of any medium, probably which has taken a certain gestation period and adoption across decades, Social media has crossed that frontier and probably got adoption within the last five years at 4x that, 4x that pace. And this especially happened in the short video space. And if you look at, if you look at the entire ecosystem, how it's changed, look at the access to tech, data has become cheaper, smartphones have become cheaper. Not only has it has created a completely new ecosystem, but it's also allowed people to have their expressions create a new forms of engagement, create uh, create videos, create fan clubs, showcase their talent, and not only not only create this fame, but also start monetizing this fame uh, by by showing sh interacting with uh, showcasing brands, showcasing uh, commerce, you know, ability to uh, manage from content to commerce. And so that's the big development that has happened over the last five years. Even if you look at last one, one and a half years, if you look at the advent of short, uh, short video space, as per the, the recent report of Red Sea, around 240 million people are on short video space exclusively. This is just extremely short video space like Moj uh, and the new ecosystem that has come over the last one and a half to, to two years. This is expected to double in the next two years. And, and, and that, that is the real opportunity that we are looking for as, a, as, as ShareChat and Moj where we see that you know in next two years the short video space will double its uh, double its uh, and in probably in another five years it will touch around 800 900 million users on, in this ecosystem if you take a step back and start looking at where is this coming from where what is the key contributor to this ecosystem i think first and foremost is that we all know that we uh, around the top 100 150 million had a certain set of content consumption and the rest of India, we just assume that they'll probably be looking at the same set of content or, or, or similar form of content. But what we have now realized is with the power of uh, machine learning and the power of uh, artificial intelligence, this whole thing has now uh, emerged that, you know, there are different social graphs, there are different interest, interest groups and our ability to now start looking at Personalization of content has opened up complete new insight on these consumers. Different, different geographies, different interest groups have completely different taste. And that has, that has fueled the complete, this ecosystem completely in a new way, giving us new insights on our consumers, the way they interact with our audience, the content, the, the way they consume content, and kind of what are the predictable new forms of content that they like. And most of these people that we are talking about or the consumers that we are talking about are these coming from tier two, tier three, tier four towns. And, and, and that's, that's a huge window of opportunity for brands, marketers and advertisers as we, as we go forward. So I think one is this whole opportunity that it has opened up tier two, tier three, tier four. 
The uh, second is this whole personalization game has ch changed the way we believe content used to get traction or trends that we see. And how how is this hyper local content? How is this hyper local trends uh, coming into the fore for brands and marketers to use it to engage with the new audiences? And not only this, we had we had we had this belief that you know. Uh, India is very skewed towards the top 100 million having the power of commerce or power of uh, power of money. And what we have realized is that, you know, and, and we are launching this new Bharat report uh, using this forum, we will realize not only these, the audiences that we are talking about are affluent, they have power of commerce, they're, they're interacting, they're engaging with their, uh, with their audiences in a much, much better way and in a, in a slightly different way, uh, whether, it's, whether it is the use of smartphones, whether it's uh, use of consumer durables, the, whether they, they're using content to commerce as a, as a window and directly moving into commerce channels. It's, it's a huge opportunity that has opened up and that's uh, and completely, we believe that this is a, this is a, this is a place that is, is a key to watch out because we fully believe that if India has to grow in the next one decade at double digit growths over the next one decade, I think it's, the, it's the power of tier two, tier three, tier four India coming to the fore. The next phenomenon that we have observed is the is this whole growth of uh, creators or the, or what we call as power of micro influence i mean if, if if what we have seen over the emergence ever since we have worked on share chat and then the last two years on merge we have seen the content fuel has multiplied 10x or at least four five times from the creator economy where not only the you know improvement of camera the filters and lenses has accentuated people to start thinking that they can be creators they can they can express new forms of their own uh, forms of expression showcase their talent and that has across multiple platforms that has completely emerged into a new sector uh, we believe that the content ecosystem uh, will be completely fueled by this creator ecosystem and we believe that Video commerce or social commerce is completely going to grow probably 100x uh, over the next few years because it is this micro influence uh, that that is actually in engaging our audiences better is engage is able to connect in a in a, a to their audiences in a much better way uh, and we are almost seeing when we do ads when we do brand ads which are made by creators or influence uh, or even micro influencers we see a 2x or 3x interaction with the audiences that we see we have done an exclusive partnership with uh, with flipkart uh, over the next 2 years where we want to fuel this ecosystem where we can actually uh, make the dream come true of you know content leading to commerce uh, this is something that we will probably accentuate using use your micro influencers nano influencers and 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 to a great extent you know, fulfill their requirement through through the Flipkart channel. Just to summarize my session today, what are the key takeaways? Uh, point number one, I would say, in India, as we have seen it, we have probably experienced the top 100, 150 million people's behaviors, tastes, and, 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 and interests. I think the diversity is going to come into the fore. And as we see that as internet penetration is growing, the power of infrastructure, the fintech economy is growing, we see that the, the economy will get fueled by the power of Bharat, the next 300 to 500 million users coming into internet and publishers and marketers will use this as a big access point to engage with their audiences better. I think the second point that I would love to say is that uh, with, the, with the decreased attention span, the short video space is completely going to take up the uh, next wave wave. Uh, especially with uh, you know cheaper smartphones, uh, filters, tools, camera techniques, this is going to be a big fuel across age, gender, geography, and and that's something that we see uh, you know taking this uh, taking up the new wave in the in the next in the coming time. The third point that I would love to say is that is is the emergence of creator marketplace. I think this is an this is a complete untapped opportunity which we have seen over the last one two years, especially on ShareChat and Moj where we believe that the grassroots talent, the grassroots power of people will start coming into the fore and there's the entire emergence of micro influence, nano influence, hyper local content uh, is, going, is going to come into the fore to engage with our users and, and our ability to not only create fuel, more uh, monetization opportunities, but it also get, creates a huge amount of job opportunities and, and talent opportunities for the creators acro across across India. Last but not the least, we believe 
the future lies in video commerce, social commerce. We think the emergence of creator economy, the micro market influence is going to open up the economy almost 100x. We believe with the new, new technology, access to tools will help brands, consumers use this creator economy, engage with their audiences and make users move from awareness to making a buy in a much shorter cycle using video commerce and social commerce. We as leaders in this in this domain, especially in the language first domain and in the short video space are completely, uh, completely focused in making this a large business, not only ensure it as a, as a big engagement point for brands and advertisers with their users, but also make it a very, very safe uh, user place, uh, uh, you know, ability to access technology, ability to access new tools, uh, making sure that making sure that the content to commerce dream comes true in the coming years. Thank you so much. Thank you, Mr. Vargas, for sharing these insights on short video space. Ladies and gentlemen, keep asking questions from our experts and don't forget to share the highlights on social media using the hashtag ETBrandParat.